slow down, man. We're going to get right to it, man. I got 40 bars here, man. So we got a lot to get into. We got a lot to talk about. So let me let, let, let me let me see if I can get her. Hold on. 40, what up? What's popping? What's popping? Oh, shit. What's going down, man? You know what it is. Conversations with a queen. And we got the queen herself, man. What's going on, man? Come on, man. Am I the queen? What's popping, man? Am I the queen? No. Oh, you just man. talking that Yo, here shit. Here we go. We start. Everybody. We start early. We start early. Yeah, we start early. Let's get to it. Shit. Let's get to it. Let's, Let's get, get to, to it, it, man. You and E Hart, man, <laughs> going <laughs> back and forth like two animals <laughs> that weekend, man. Nah, Yo, nah, 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 nah. And her just like I don't even gonna hold you. Like I don't make excuses. You know that. But I was a little saucy, so. That's the only reason why I was a little bit more louder than I would have been. She wasn't acting like an animal. That was me, mad hurt brat. Oh my god! But whatever, it is what it is. Okay, yeah, okay, that's what it is, man. But you know, in, in spite of that, everybody, everybody liked what they saw. You know what I'm saying? So it got people more amped to even want to see y'all battle. You feel what I'm saying? Right, so right, right. We right. we we gonna get we gonna get right to here, man. This right here, this battle between you and E Heart, man. Everybody say it's for the queendom, man. It's for that crown. It's for that throne, you know. It's, it's all the marbles. They all. It, it's all about here, right here. You know what I'm saying? How do you feel about this battle? Forty bars. Talk to me. I feel. I'm excited about this battle. Like, um, I have, matter of fact, I have like a lot of mixed emotions. Like, I, I really wanted to battle Ehar when I first came into it. You know, she's a bitch to beat. You know, she still is. You know, um, she got bars. Like, she. You know, she's dope, but then there was a lot of other things, like, her inactivity kind of, like, turned me off because, like, people talk about E-Heart when she has a battle or when they mention a ghost, but she's not someone that's constantly mentioned on a day-to-day. I, there was a point in time when, like, she was, she wasn't to me, she was, she was, I don't know, I don't know how to say it. I don't want to say she wasn't popping and she is, I don't know, it's weird. Long story short, like, I just, there became, there was a point in time when I, I didn't want to battle her as much. I didn't see it was as being as important as, let's say, battle an official or jazz or, you know what I mean? So my mind, I have mixed emotions. But this battle is, is really important to to a lot of people, you know what I mean? Especially my team, mm-hmm. like, important to them. So okay, it's important, okay. important for me. Okay, yeah, I mean, you know, you have been out here cooking, you know, and you know, this is, like, probably the first, well, not the first, I can't say because it's next year, but, you know, she took a battle, like, kind of like back-to-back, you know, she just uh, did the C3 battle, and, you know, she's a couple of months away from, you know, the battle with you and her. So she's probably a little bro, bit more bro, active. Can you, than... can, you, can you stop? Can you stop? Let's stop. What, 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 what? I got to keep my button on the trigger? What, what's Listen, going on, she, man? Yeah, her C3 battle on Cut it out. She's not back to back. They just battled in August, and she's not battling until February. Cut it out. It's not okay, back to my back. My fault. My fault. All right. All right. I hear you. I hear you. Well, let's say this. This battle with you and E Heart, man, is it as important or more important than the battle with you and Jazz? Um, I didn't think it was, but as of late, yeah, I, I, I think I definitely think it might be more important than me and Jazz. I think me and Jazz was. Was, was was a huge thing. It's like, hey, there's the battle of the, the kind of the witty bitches, you know what I mean? But right, a lot of got us, you, got you, got you. Know you. Because we were it wasn't, it wasn't looked like it was like it wasn't looked as the battle for like the like the queen and shit, like you know. Yeah, so, right. Oh, right, right, right. So it wasn't like a uh, yo, who's the queen of the ring here? Like you know what I'm saying? I don't think that battle was for right. that. Um, it was it was definitely. I think this one is more important. Just because of now, that. I think this is you know this is my assessment of it. You have both queens in your own right, you know what I'm saying, and 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 you know, both of y'all have you know a contrast towards each other as far as like her not battling as much, and you're battling more often, but you get results as of you know the place that the fans and the you know the, the people put you on. You know what I'm saying? So it's like. This right here is gonna just sum it all. It's gonna be like, okay, is the is the battling not much just as effective as battling 
as much and shit. It's all going to come to yeah, a head. Like, yeah, you know, which one? He says people's argument is quality over quantity, and I respect that. Like, there's a lot of arguments over, like, oh, boy, you battle a lot more, and, you're, and, you're, and your battles aren't as good as the ones she does. I, I'm not an idiot. Like, so, and I can I can respect that. But on the same token, like, if niggas only battled once a year, like, there'll be no fucking female battle rap. You guys would not be in no fucking BBQs. You guys, I mean, BB Kings, like, it wouldn't be like it wouldn't be like how much female battle rap has grown, how big like it wouldn't be like that if you was only throwing a card once a year, Debo, and you know that. We all know I that. I'm not that. Is what it is. That. I'm not saying I changed the game, but my grind along with a lot of other people's grind, like it helped I think it helped expand the brand. And but this is and the question I wanna ask you. Okay. Mm-hmm. okay. I I'll mean to cut you off. This is the question I wanna ask you. You know. I salute that you do battle often. Mm-hmm. And you know, a person with your intricate bars, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of hard putting your material together. How do you even keep up with doing so and being consistent? You know what I'm saying? At least it's more consistent than any year because you, I don't see you really choking or fucking up as much and shit. How can? How do you do that? Um, I know it's gonna sound funny and shit, but like my memory is actually like really good. You know what I mean? Um, my memory, I can memorize something really well, really quickly. My problem is writing the bars in a decent amount of time. So once I get the bars done, I can I can memorize, you know, my, my bars. I, I memorized my Barney, my Barney bars in like three days. You know what I mean? But okay. And I was flawless. I didn't choke. I did nothing. But that's because I wanted to win. I liked my material. I was confident and I was determined. But I don't... I mean, okay, I so... Like different, different platforms. Everything... I'm On every platform, I'm not intricate. I don't... I don't see people's life away on every platform. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, I battle people outside of Queen of the Ring. I, I battle for wherever I'm at. I didn't bring those kind of bars to Miami because that's not the shit they wanted to hear in Miami. I battled, when I battle okay. people in Philly, it's different. It's not Queen of the Ring shit everywhere. Every, you got to know how to win, man. That's what my whole thing is. You got to know how to win. All right. Same so bar- so with, that, with, with that said, you know what I'm saying? If I wouldn't be asking this question, man. This wouldn't be a conversation with a queen. It wouldn't be real. Right. Your memory's good, 40. Why was your right. memory as sharp as it was when you battled Jazz? What, what was the problem there? Let's, let's no, get you this out the way for, for good. <laughs> let's get it out. Let's get it. Let's you know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to take no shit. shots. Let's, Yo, let's, let's get it out it. the way forever. Come like, on, let the Queen of the Ring, because this, this is going on Queen of the Ring channel. Let the Queen of the Ring fans yeah, know what the fuck happened. Shit. Yo, my nigga, I think it was a lot. Pressure, fucking just me being tired. I, I, I don't know. I, I wish I could answer you. Like, that's why I said when I told you, I'm like, this is going to be funny as shit with the jazz shit. But, yo, I don't know what the fuck happened. I don't know what the fuck okay. happened. Jazz might have had me okay. shook, man. I don't fucking know. I might have been scared, man. She was, jazz was in that ring glowing, man. I don't know what the fuck happened, man. That bitch had me scared. Oh, shit. Oh. Come on. All right. All right. All right. Stop being funny. Stop being funny. I'm anyway. not. People, you I'm a clown. Don't tell me I'm being funny. I'm genuinely telling you, like, I don't know. Are you generally you telling me you were scared of Jazz the Rapper, son? When Maybe she that was up it. on you and shit, that's man. When, when yo, she had that white beater and she had the, what you know? the, 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 the bandana yeah, print with, uh, with the bun uh, in her hair. <laughs> Jazz was pretty in our battle, but no, nah, all jokes aside, all jokes aside, I don't know what the fuck it was. Let's keep it a buck. I had just spit all three of my rounds to Shayna Ashley downstairs. I exchanged some words with Tori Doe. I come downstairs and it was like, that was it. I knew walking into the ring because I'm always going over my bars in my mind, like, whatever. So when I'm walking to the ring, and I was just like, yo, come over here and get mic'd up, whoop doo doo but whatever. Yo, my nigga, I just looked at my homegirl. I'm like, yo, let me see your glasses real quick. And I grabbed her glasses because I'm like, yo, it's going to be a long night. I knew right then and there when I walked into the ring, I knew it was over. I'm not even going to lie. I knew it was over. You do the, you do the infamous shades on. Everybody knowing Queen of the Ring what the shades mean. <laughs> no, no, just a lot of people. A lot of people wear shades just on their shit, and but that's not my thing. Yeah, a lot of the, a lot of the thing. girls wear shades when they don't know their material, or, or they like, yeah, I, I don't want, yeah, I want no parts of this shit right here. I'm going to oh, cover see, my reaction. See, no, I don't think so, cause QB used to wear shades, and I don't think that was a problem. Like QB don't be choking and shit. Oh no, nah, QB don't be talking about. I think when it was the first time she battled, she battled Sky and shit. She wanted to feel a little comfortable and shit, you know. So she just wanted oh, to wear the shades okay. just in case. But I think the second time she just had it for a cool effect and shit. But yeah, you know, it it, it 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 is what it is. But, but let me let me ask, let me. 
that's not my thing. And that's why I had them on because I didn't want to, I was on some punk shit. I'm like, damn, I'm really going to have to look at all these people. Like, I just know what the fuck <laughs> is. I didn't even want to walk in the <laughs> ring, nigga. Okay. Well, let me ask you this. Let, let, let me ask you this. Do you have any battles in between time before E-Heart? Because, you know, I remember the last time when you battled jazz, people was kind of like, you know, feeling a way about you having battles before <laughs> then and shit like that to see if you was going to light and be taking it serious and shit. What about this battle? Yeah, man. I do. <laughs> oh, boy. Here we go. Who you I got, do. man? I just wrote, you see, I just wrote for that fucking that Jimmy Jazz symbol and contest, too. Right. No, but I'm not. I don't make the same mistake twice. I'm not going to get in there and take something that close to E-Heart or something that I don't already have. I got mad bars left over that I didn't use for the Jimmy Jazz shit, so that's going to cover. I don't want to tell you I'm right. more battling because y'all are going to laugh, but I got a one round with a dude in January. I mean, Beretta Blake oh, okay. got a one round. But one round is not as serious as, like, having the, like, no, the three rounds saying, and like, shit like that. So yeah, I'm not going to make the same yeah. mistake. I'm not going to take three three full-length battles. Like, that was kind of crazy. And I didn't. I know that yo, going and, in. Right. And, yo, yo real quick, what, what the fuck? What happened with the Jimmy Jazz battle? Like, explain yourself. I explain Explain shit, yourself, cuz. It was fucked up, cuz, man. At the end of the day, my ride flicked on me. And I was, I don't want to drive my fucking car because the suspension is kind of shot. I, I don't know. Whatever. Long story short. Now niggas going to be like, oh, he's got a hoopie. Ah, whatever. But um, it didn't, like, my ride flicked on me. And last minute, I'm not a quitter, so I went to the bus knowing I was going to be late. So, Rock, you heard, which is my nigga. I hit him up, and he kept, like, yo, just try to get here anyway. He was, got in contact with everybody, and so I was going to be late with everything that could go wrong at all. So I was going to pull off the 441 that I was on the side of the road for another, like, half an hour, 45 minutes. By the time I got off the bus, they was texting me that Prezi won. Got you. Got you. Got you. Okay. Well, um, I would have you, What you said? You would have what? I would have won that shit. You would have won that shit? Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Oh, let, let's talk about, let, let's, <laughs> so let's go here. Let's talk about this. The two one two with you and Bonnie versus DNA and K Sean, man. You know, how, how, historic battle. Very historic. How do you feel about that? You know what I'm saying? The preparation, like you you know, you actually you and Bonnie actually had chemistry. People like what y'all did, man. How do you feel about that battle? I was I was when I left the building, I didn't like the battle. I didn't feel like we won the way I wanted us to. Like, I didn't feel like I won the battle when I left. Or we won the battle, excuse me. Um, when I watched the footage when it came out, it's really like, and I hear people like, oh, it's a preference battle, but that, it just really is going to be a preference battle. They were super fucking funny. Our bars were stellar. You know what I mean? And we worked really hard on it because we knew that people, like, kept doubting us. Like, I was in New York for a week in a fucking hotel room. I brought my daughter. Like, you know what I'm saying? You know that, people. Like, I, I fucking, I'm really like, yo, me and Bonnie's in this hotel room up in fucking Midtown. Then Bonnie came down to my house for a week. Like, you know, like, back and forth. Like, really hard on doing it. And we already knew going forward, it doesn't matter how much we chilled or practiced. There's no way to compare guys who have been friends for years and have done four and five. Are you fucking texting? What is that? Who, me? What is that noise? No, nah, that was, that was, don't worry about that. Go ahead, man. Keep going. Don't worry Keep about that. Going. That was like fucking, you're typing, typing what the fuck I'm saying. It sounds crazy. You know what? No, no, no. I'm done with my, I'm done with my, I'm done with my shit, huh? You just fucked up my whole little story. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, what you were saying? No, nah, but um, all jokes aside, but me and Bonnie knew going forward, like, we're, we're associates, we're cool. We've gotten more cool, especially since the two on two, but. These these dudes have been friends for years. They've done this shit like four or five times before me and Bonnie did it. So we weren't going to be able to compare to that. We just wanted to, we wasn't going to get killed, which we didn't. I think that if you want to hear bars, we won. If you want to laugh once or twice in a round, then they won. <laughs> All right? I got you. Got you, got you, got you. So you felt like, you know, the chemistry between you and Bonnie and shit, like, y'all, y'all, y'all feel like, um, you know, do y'all feel like on a two on two, y'all had the best chemistry and shit? Like out doing any other, you know? Well, there's only one other female two on two, which is Shuni and and um no, and no, Farrah no. and shit. No, I don't. And that's another thing. Like Shuni and Farrah, they're hard to like. Me and Bonnie couldn't match that chemistry either. Bar wise, yeah, we could. Like me and Bonnie are more bar heavy than Shuni and Farrah. You know what I mean? But they have they perform better and they also have better chemistry. I don't think you can compare us like that. You know what I mean? 
that's another set of friends who actually fucks with each other and you know what I mean? Like post pictures, they right. go shopping, whatever of each other. It's different versus me leaving me living three hundred miles away from Bonnie. And that's just being right. you know, I thought it before, let's get this in, you know. So I don't I don't think you can compare the two, especially like chemistry and stuff. But um I think Now let's I, talk I, about no, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, cause I, we ain't got too much time, so I just want no, to get into this. Let's talk about that. this. I wasn't even saying nothing like that. Oh, okay. Let's talk. You and Shayna, you know what I'm saying? Pretty pretty underrated battle, but it was dope nonetheless. And shit. Do you feel like, you know, how you feel about that battle? Do you feel like you won that battle? Because she's saying she won. And you know Bro, what I'm saying? I, I don't really. Let me, tell you, let me tell you something. Let me tell you why it's fucking underrated. And that's why people think I'm, I think I'm crazy, right? And there's all the reason in the world just dying shit when I drop the ball with Jazz. All right, fine. But every time I've gotten somebody, like, coming to the shit, Sarah was that bitch. Shayna was that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Whatever, whatever. These were all people who people wanted to beat or, or admired or fucked with or were popular girls. When I start beating motherfuckers, our battles are downplayed. And because of what? I didn't fucking choke, stumble, fuck up, or none of that shit. Me and Sarah's battle, it took place at, what, 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. I washed Sarah. It is what it is. And to me, to me, and... Nobody gives a fuck about the battle. All right, cool. That's fine. It was a boring battle in general. Fine. Cool. Shayna, I clearly beat Shayna. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. I don't care what anybody says. I clearly beat Shayna, Ashley. Why is that battle so underrated? Like, why? Because it's 40 bars battling somebody who was popping or who's popping. Like, anybody else? I don't know. I don't know. You know, I think everybody can't stand me, so I don't even want to. That's why they're fucking underrated. Because, <laughs> that's why. Because of you? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh man, man, come on, man! You know everybody fuck with you, man. Stop playing them games. Man. I'm just saying, my nigga. It's always an exception to the rule with me. It's always, I, you know, I, whatever. I don't need no pity party because it is what it is. But that's how I feel. Not for nothing. With, well, like, just you, you, me, the battle's not as popping for whatever reason. Niggas say I don't perform well, like from years ago since I don't perform no more. Like still. Well, well, shit. You, you, that you was performing when um. You and Bonnie, I was giving it up. I was getting crazy. You know, I I I think I've improved my performance a little bit every time, but let people still tell them. Like, but no, nah, yeah, nah. Well, you and Shana, you was performing too. Yeah, you and Shana, you was performing. You was, you know, you was, you was doing it. I guess you was doing it the forty way. You know what I'm saying? You can't but be, a, you know, somebody else. Like, but niggas won't say that E Hart don't have a performance. They won't say that, and we all know it. But it's just like one of those things we won't say. They won't say it mm-hmm. because it's E Hart. You understand? Mm-hmm. She talks. She'll stand in the middle of the ring and tap people's chests and talk to that shit. Ooh, but that's not performance. Cause I move around mm-hmm. more than her, and they, I don't move around. Mm. Okay, okay, that's what I it is. Very legit, bro. I'm telling you, because it's me, man. That's why. That's why I'm gonna do my thing. I can't wait to this battle anymore. Anyway. So let, let me ask you a question. When when did you decide? That you said, you know what? Fuck it, I'm the queen of this shit, man. This is my shit, man. Like, when, when was, when, when was, what battle? What, 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 uh, what year? What, you know, date and time? Like, when did you decide? You know that's what? A, this is my shit. That's a good fucking question because I did not think I was the queen of the ring for a while. I used to be like, no, nah, I, you know, um, I don't know. I don't know when the date of time is. I think when I realized like how much I put into this shit and how hard I work and how like much people fuck with me, like. It was a mixture of things, you know. Right. Okay. 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 Um. Were you were you ever get it shaken? Were you an official man? You said what? I said, will you ever get it shaken? Were you were you an official eventually? Yeah, that's definitely some people. That's I, I'm not. You said it like I'm. N W S versus Vitas Block, nigga. Don't say it like you're throwing her out. Don't say that and make people think, like, oh, 40, what you don't want? Nah, nah, nah. I don't give a fuck. Man, officials can do that. Like, we can do it. Like, I don't care. Officials dope. Um, people want to Let's keep that. it 100. No, let's keep it 100 because we ain't want no boring ass coming. Let's keep it 100. Because I'm going to add to this, too, if I get on the honor what you call it. Do you feel her stock is not where you want it to be when you wanted to battle her after the, the hustle and luck battle? Or do you just feel like, you know what I'm saying, she's still... You know, you Hell still want to yeah. be crazy. Let's keep it real. Hustle, hustle fucking fucked her up. And niggas want to, like, that's another prime example of why sometimes people let people get away with shit. Official was good. Niggas talk about 40, you got killed by jazz. We'll do it. That's cool, but let's, 
Nigga, like, I didn't fucking say half of my bars. It's really worse when you go up there and spit the material of your life per official. I wrote the bars of my life, and you still clearly got fucked up. No, nigga, no. No, no, no. So what I look like just taking it like I just... I haven't heard these in a while. Oh, I haven't heard those fuck. in a while. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Nah. Her stock is dropping. People are tired. She gave a lackluster performance versus Lady Luck. Like, nobody wants, like, officials one-dimensional. She's dope. She's good. But she's one-dimensional. I'm not starving to battle her. She doesn't spark me. At least if I battle E Hart, then it's going to be like, all right, bitch, you're the queen or she's the queen. At least if something I battle officials, you're going to be like, all right, it's good and not battle. Nobody says officials the queen of the ring. You're so fucking dumb. That just sound like Gettysburg. You're so dumb letting off on the triad shot. <laughs> yo, yo, man. This is crazy. Now, so since we get into the issue of Queen of the Ring, I got to tell you something, man. You're going to hear it. You're going to hear it when I drop it, you know what I'm saying, soon. That's I got to let you I know something. Man. Yo. My verse ran down on Bonnie in that battle and told her I'm the queen of the ring. Let's go, my verse. <laughs> You're so dumb. You're so dumb. I love my verse. That's my sister. She That's said, I'm sister. the queen of the ring, man. Yo, listen, man. Everybody out for blood. Oh, fuck all that Everybody should shit. Tell, I mean, listen, with all due respect to my verse, and I'm not even going to, you're not about to get me to try to shade my. Everybody. Listen, everybody I ain't tell you, listen, I ain't tell you to no, shade no, nobody. No, Don't put I'm me in that, that, that box. No, shut up, shut up, shut up, because you know how I am. Like, here's my thing. With all due respect to my verse, everybody has a claim to the queen of the ring. Cool. But, like, whether or not it's legit. You know what I'm saying? It's different, and it has nothing to do with our talent set or whatever like that. Cause my verse is dope. To me, there's a certain criteria to be really actually considered the queen of the ring, whether or not you got vet status like E Heart, which is solely the reason why people say she's queen of the ring. I promise you, she's been around since y'all started this shit. I'm not mad. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Grenade has been thrown. What the fuck was that? Was that the, is that the sole reason why she's queen of the ring? Because she has a vet status and she started a queen of the ring before a, a lot of girls? No, E-Heart's the only, girl who ain't, she's the only girl who ain't bad of nowhere. She started with y'all. Cause it's, it's all the girls who started with y'all, E-Heart, she, she had the first battle on queen of the ring. She's the forefather of queen of the ring. Why wouldn't niggas consider her the queen? I'm not that. Yeah, because you know, but but she could have she. But listen, it's not to the it's not to the. You trying to say it's not to the fact that she's nice because there's girls that started in Queen of the Ring, you know, I didn't and they're not right. considered that. You know, I did. That's not why. That's not why. We all know she's nice. Cut it out. Cut it out. We know you hard. To okay, so we're, we're, let's get back to this, let's get back to this my verse thing with her saying she's the Queen of the Ring. She ain't the Queen of the Ring. I, I don't know. I think I listen. I think she has some some type of validation. I'm just saying, man. She no, got, you know, she got crazy. No, she's dope, getting crazy out no here, man. She that has Puerto no claim Rican to the woman throne. is getting crazy out here on the 40. She is, but she now, has no claim to the throne. I'm sorry. Not right now. Not yet. Not yet. And that's just to me. Because to me, I think there's a lot more things you got to do. At the place that you're calling your, 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 what's that? What the fuck is that your called? Heart. Your kingdom. Bang. You know, like, you got to put a certain amount of work in the kingdom to claim the throne. Stop it with the shit. <laughs> you're so, so what you're so trying bad. to say, you're you trying, you, you, you trying to call, you trying to call my verse when she's like a, 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 a she's still a, a peasant. That's what you're trying, trying to say, Slick you know, Rick? I'm, That's I'm, what you're I'm saying? Gonna you you. I'm going to slap you when I see you. I never, would never say that. Not about her. There's bitches in Queen of Ring. You need to watch your mouth, 40, man, because my yeah. verse is that deal. You hear me? I seen the light. You understand what I'm trying to tell you? Yeah. I turned oh, around to oh. e and them. I said, yo, this girl's coming for all of y'all. No, nah, my verse is dope. I said she's coming. She's coming, man. Get ready. Put some that's bars cool. aside for this, this but right lady, now, man. No, and that's cool, and that's what I'm saying. But as of right now, she does not have a legitimate claim to the throne. That's my opinion. I, 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 could, I could probably see your theory on that. I'll get, hey, you know, but, you know, why not, that's man? You got to have confidence. You got to have confidence in yourself. I just told you you're supposed to do that. I, I said I was one. No, I'm lying. 
I did not say I was queen of the ring before I, I felt like I put enough work. No, I, I can't even say that. People do it all the time. There's nothing wrong with that. Okay. She's dope. She's talented. She feels like she's a queen of the ring. I just feel like there's a criteria certain people got to meet to be my queen of the ring, and that's why, to me, she's not. Okay. Well, not give, me somebody, give me somebody spanking brand new that you would take on the brand. Cause I don't give a fuck about outside the brand because in the ring it matters most. That's my new claim to fame. That's my new tag. In the ri- it matters most in the ring. Who in the ring that's spanking brand new that you see that, you know, is worthy of at least a shot out of the new girls? Who in the ring is, like, like how new? Like, what is it? Like, you know, who? I mean, they could be real new. They could be little new. What, however new you feel like they, 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 they before you. You know what I'm saying? They, the ones that came after you. Yeah, I'll take all these bitches on. I don't give a fuck, people. You know me. I don't give a fuck. You pay me on <laughs> No disrespect. I fuck them. I don't give a fuck. As long as they're not trash. Like KCJ dope. Nina, C, Autumn, they all dope. Like, with, like, eight off. Like, they're all good. Like, I would battle any of them. Like, I don't care. It just matters, like, especially if it's, like, a rookie versus vet situation because, you know, everything I do has to make sense to me. Yo, but listen, off, I'm driving. Dri- I'm, dri- I'm, you know? Listen, I'm, I'm driving the car, and I'm going to make a left on this situation I'm about to give to you. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm going to talk, talk about this one girl, Diesel. Who? Diesel. Oh, I didn't even mention Diesel. Diesel's pretty good too. Yep, Diesel's good. You think you think Diesel give you that work? Diesel be jumping no. all in your they, face they, and shit on some normal they, they, base they, they, shit. None of them, none of them would give me no work. Make no mistake. I just said I would battle them and they're good. Don't get it fucked up. I didn't say none of them would give me anything. <laughs> Mulatto Black got them bars, man. Writer, she. Definitely not giving me no work either. A lot of black, no, not at all. Wow, the rhymes will get crazy on you. Cut it out. Cut it out. Cut it out, man. Shut some of them. All right. All right, let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. Here we go. Um, people who I think we can have dope battles with classics debatables or like you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna say anybody would ever give me that work, but people who I think are good like that, um nobody, team forty, ain't nobody fucking with me, nigga. Don't get a fuck up. That's Let's it. get it. <laughs> <laughs> No, this is why nobody likes me because I play too much and nobody knows my personality. It's like I'm like, yo, buddy, smash that up. Like, I don't even give a fuck at this point, people. You know, I don't care no more. But I play too much. But nah, shout out to all of them. They're good. I don't think anybody can give me no work. Nobody should think anybody would give them work. Can people be competition wise? Of course. We should always respect that. But nobody's not giving me no work. Okay. Let me ask you a question. Do you feel like the female Maybe battle rappers are questions for the last half an hour. I know. I know. That's my thing. I say, let me ask you a question. So, um, you think female battle rap is evolving? I do. I do. Ball wise, ball wise, you think that it's evolving? Like you know, you see more girls coming out of woodwork. You know, yeah, I think more girls are, are. Yeah, I think more girls are, are are making it a point to be to try and craft their bars a little bit better. Cause a lot of the girls, in, when I first started watching Battle Rap, they was basic as shit. Like, good or not, it was basic stuff. So I think the yeah, things are becoming more complex. Oh, there's a parking spot in front of my house. Let me go get it. But, um, yeah. Okay, okay, all right. So, um, let me see, let me see. Oh, I'm going to drive the car and go left. Oh, y'all niggas again. I'm going to put you on the spot, son. I'm going to put you on the spot. You ready for it? I'm good. You know what? Let me save that for later. No, no, no. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. Watch the throne, too. You know how it's going down. you seen the card out there. Let's make some quick predictions. Now we got Shayna versus we got Shayna Shayna Ashley versus QB Black Diamond man thinking man who winning who you got who you putting the house on 
I'm going with New England, man. Uh, oh, I'm not, shit. Right, I'm going to keep it a buck. I'm Dana. Keep it a buck. Yeah, I'm going to I'm I'm go, I'm go with QB on this battle. You're going to QB on this battle? Okay, okay. Yeah, let's, let's go to that's the... That's going to be debatable. That should be debatable. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, all right. Let me stop playing. Okay. I just finished talking. Back to focus. QB and Shayna. Um... Uh, I'll give it to I'll give it to QB two one, but I wouldn't be surprised if Shane did two one either. Like I feel I can go either way, depending on who's on this show. All right. Tonight. All right. What about um? Let's let's, let's go with uh, Couture versus Tory. Couture and Tory. People are amped about that battle, huh? Um, yeah. Now nah, people be going crazy about that battle. Um. I don't know, man. Um, I'm going to go with Couture. You going with who? I'm going to go with Couture 2 one. Again, I wouldn't be surprised if Tori beat her, though, either. You know what I mean? I don't know. Stop making good guys. That's so funny. Stop it. You're repping for New England, man. You're out here repping for New England, man. You said I'm repping for New England? You said I'm repping for New England? New York is doing all the yeah. fucking time. Fuck out of here. Shit. All right, so the two on two, but man. I'm not two on two. If Tori win, that's not. I wouldn't be surprised. Tori still got what she does too. Okay, two on two, man. You got Farrah and Shuni versus C and Nina. Who you got? All I hear is silence. Yeah, who you got? You said who versus who? Two on two, Farrah and Shuni versus Nina and C. Oh, that's gonna be a goodie. Uh, um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's a good fucking card, man. I normally could. I normally could pick clear winners. I don't know. Like you said, Shuni and Farrah, they got a dope chemistry. They've done it before, but I know Nina and C got a dope chemistry too because they're super close. I just haven't seen them perform together. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I'm excited for that battle. That's a little either way. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Okay. The I think Shuni and Farrah perform a little bit stronger, but I I think Nina and C bars are a little stronger, so that could go either way. Okay. Okay. Now, uh, Ms. Merck versus Mirage. So who you got? Oh, another goodie. Another goodie. God damn it. I'm gonna go with Mirage. Oh shit. Marasha. I'm gonna go with Marasha. Merch, merch is like okay. the punch. Merch is like Merch is like the punch queen, but I just Marasha is so fucking charismatic. She fucking rebuttals like the bitch is hard to beat, man. I'm gonna go with Marasha. Mm. Okay. That don't mean okay. I don't want Merch to win though. I hate giving predictions because I fuck with people, but whatever. Guys, who else? Yo, let me. Oh, what's, yo, what happened with you and Saga, man? Y'all was going back and forth and shit, man. What, what was going on there? Yeah, I was so melted. I don't even know what happened. I just remember he was saying he was bigger than me or she something. She said she was melted. He, I was, I was, he was bigger than me or something, and he was saying that he had um, he had more views than me, and that shit flew my fucking head like, boy, bye. So I said, nobody watches your battle. Get the fuck out of here. So that's why I, I was... I was forcing. I was you was arguing with but... God, man. What's wrong with you, man? No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. That nigga be talking mad shit. And they was telling me that he was all taking shots at me and battling and shit. I'm glad I did talk shit to him. Fuck him. Oh, he was getting paid three hundred dollars a battle. Fuck him. Oh, what up? Man. What up? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck him. No, man. Hold on. I'm I'm flipping, man. Hold on. Fuck I'm him. Fuck him. Oh, man. Yo. What do you think about the Lady Luck I want to do another one of these conversations where I want to just talk to people because I think people don't know me, and that's the reason why. I want people to know me as a person. I think I'm oh, one no, of the most misunderstood people in battle rap. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, nah. Nah, people fairly fuck with you and shit. They, they fuck with you and shit. You wouldn't they be fuck with me, but they think, I'm, they think I'm a bitch. They think I'm all kind of shit that I'm really not. I am a bitch, but not that kind they of bitch. You think you're hot to diddy and bougie? Yo, my nigga, they think I'm mad arrogant. I be seeing mad comments and stuff, and they think I'm, you know I'm not, but anybody who knows me knows what it is. But most of the time when I'm on pages and shit, I'm going off because I done read 30 comments of people sneak this and talking shit. So I just like, you know what, I'm going to dress everything at one time. So I always look like I'm just going off, but it is what it is. All right, all right. Um, I was, I was going to ask you, um, ask you again, like, what do you thought about the Lady Luck official battle? What am I doing about it? What do you mean? 
No, what do you what do you thought about it? What do you thought about it? I feel like a lot of people is really biased towards um luck. I feel like going into the situation, um, she definitely had a different style than what niggas was probably used to, but you know what? Um, I feel like a lot of people, they have, um, you know, I, I just, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like official came and did her, but I was just tired of seeing the same way. I feel like Luck had more bars than people gave her credit for. She just wasn't necessarily what they wanted to see at that situation. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I ain't crazy about that battle. Well, let me ask you, well, you know, fuck it then. Let's go ahead, man. With you an official, man, you feel like you, you know what I'm saying, you, you, like is she, is she somebody to worry about and shit now? Or you you know going into it, you'll be like, man, I'll fuck up. No, or at you a just point like, in time, this is gonna be cra- this is gonna time, be a crazy yes. battle. No, at a point in time. Say that again. At a point in time, official was definitely a bitch that could have took my head off. <laughs> no, no. At at a point in time, she could have got crazy on me. Like official's good, but she's one dimensional, and she's displayed the same style so many times. I'm like the Tim Duncan in this shit. I've realized how to beat that shit now. So it is what it is. Has she battled me at a point? Especially when, like, you know, like, niggas love officials. She's super aggressive. She performs. She has bars. So I'm not going to take none away from her. But had I had had she not kept battling other people before me, she might have had a chance to beat me. Not now. Just like E-Heart. She's not going to beat me because I know how to beat her. Not now. Hold on, hold on. Before we even get there, what you call official one dimensional? You hear me? Official got she bars. Is, she got performance. She got cadence. She got four bars. She got setups. a lot of things. Four man. bar setups and gun bars. Four bar setups. And then she'll say forty bar schemes. I'm like, uh, uh-uh, boo. You know I do better than that. My cadence changes. Official don't start rapping faster. She don't start rapping slower. She goes, same time, fall on, sit you down, da 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 round, da 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 time, da 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 punchline. Girl, bye. <laughs> That's one dimensional. That's one dimensional. Yeah, Everybody so clear. Everybody clear. Done with that little thing. Everybody clear. That sounds like Everybody the people clear. outside saw Facia on me, I mean, asking for change to hit in a little red thing. That's what that sounds like. Yeah, but it is what it is. I don't know. No 40, man. I, I don't. I don't oh my God, man! This shit crazy. I mean, niggas love to talk about my show comments. I don't, but I rap better than most of these bitches. I don't care. I can learn how to perform. You can't learn how to write bars better than mine. Just learn that shit. I don't. I have this shit, whatever. Listen. Only thing that you, people are gonna argue with me and Heart is who's more believable. Nobody says E Heart can rap better than me. I've never heard that. Do people say we rap as good as each other? Fine. No, he's like, yo, E Heart just can rap circles on 49. No. It's that E Heart has a, a street feel. So when she's talking about lay a nigga down, chase you around, pop up like a hot spot, and she just sitting there looking like, she looked like she might do that shit. That's cool. That's cool. But that could be taken care of too. So then what? When it comes down to a real skill level, who's really better than you? That believability shit ain't shit. Forty. Try wanting to come in there wearing like dirty don't sweats and t-shirts. 40, 40, braid my 40, hair. Don't dis- so I gotta look like I dis- fuck somebody up in order for niggas to pay attention to my bars. That's stupid. Forty. Don't dumb. disrespect E Heart. She's a legend in this game, and she's put in a lot of work. And it's just Bruh, not about I believability. Her. I she has said bars. That she has a more believable too far, feel about 40. her. Say it again. That's what happened to her. Take it too far. Official being queen of the ring. Going crazy on all the girls and shit. So niggas like, oh, official's not aggressive. Da, da, da. Then she stood in front of hustle, who's more official. I mean, more <laughs> aggressive than her. She's kind of bad. This shit's all a game. It's all a That's smoke and really mirrors. It's all smoke and mirrors. Like what <laughs> niggas believe you'll do. Not about what the fuck you're saying. It's hmm. Forty got on a dress and heels and a tight dress. Nah, she ain't gonna see that gun she's talking about. So then E Heart sitting there. She got sneakers, t-shirt, E Heart t-shirt, cornrows and shit. She looks like a nigga who might do that shit. That's how it well, you know what? Since we talking our shit, since we talking our shit, you know what I'm saying? Official did get did, did wild on jazz and shit. What do you think jazz is ranked right now and shit? Jazz is walking around here looking crazy as fuck too. You didn't see how happy I was when she lost too. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? No, no, no. I just I was I was trolling jazz too. Like 
This shit's all a clown. Niggas tried to kill me when I got fucked up, and they was like, 40 was choking. You sucked, uh, you choked up at us. The niggas wasn't doing that when people were out there, the material of their life, and still get fucked up. Like, that would make me not want to battle rap anymore. <laughs> this is a different. That would make me not want to rap. Nobody's never came so up there and killed think- me. So do you think huh? the Jazz the Rapper brand is still, you think the Jazz the Rapper brand is still as powerful as it once was after the official okay. battle? I think, I don't, I, I think, I don't think, I don't think it, I don't think it dropped or anything like that. I don't think or it dropped. Or do you think she should take on more people or, you know, in other words, like, no. you know. You know, you know like, Jazz I'm, has been there because she's a personable person. So even though she lost that battle, clearly, Jazz is in, in the loop so much, nobody's not going to give a fuck for too much because they don't see official like that outside of a battle. But Jazz is all the events. She's hosting. She's there. She's the girl next door. She just graduated from college. People like her. They don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? And that's what it boils down to. Mm -hmm. They don't care. If you're personable and you're in the culture and you're active, niggas don't give a fuck. Or they'll let it go a lot quicker than they would, you know, somebody else. All right. So with that said, let's, let's say this here. You know, a lot of girls are not in, you know, involved in the culture as much as they probably should or be seen or stuff like that or whatever. Like, you know, what, you know, if you're talking to a new girl, what would it take to be, to climb up that ladder? Cause I know a lot of girls ask me for advice or, you know, want me to put them in a position so where they, they could win and shit like that and be up there where y'all at and shit, which is cool. But you know, what, what, you know, what else do they need to do to get to that, you know, to that next level and shit? That's really one of those situations where it's like different strokes for different folks. Because as you can see, E Hart is huge, and she only battled she only battled eight times. I'm huge, and I battled three times that amount, so I can't say what works for me is going to work for somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Like right. I I had a plan. I know what I wanted to do. I knew that. Like I was like, yo, I want to be. I want people to watch me more than anybody else. That's what I wanted coming into the situation. So if I got to battle more and have more views like that, if that's what I need to do, this is what I want people to see when they talk about female battle rap. I want them to mention forty bars, and that's why I'm. I, I work the way I do. But, again, E. Hart started with the beginning of, of the Queen of the Ring, so her name's automatically always going to be associated with something huge. So she doesn't have to battle as much either. Everything's different mm-hmm. for different people. I just would say decide what you want to make out of it. Like, are you just battling just to have fun? Then fine. I'm battling to be that bitch in battle rap. Mm. So that's why I work so mm. hard. Some people just battle because they're nice and they can do that. Depends on what you're trying to accomplish. That then your goals need to your goals need to match that. You know what I mean? You're 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 considered you're not considered. It's actually true. You're the highest viewed female battle rapper in the world. Now, yep. You know, as far as that you know is that concerned, shit. Your legacy as as far as the people you battle, it's not too many people that you know that's you know that's a course from you that's super top tier the people people will be like, Oh yeah, she battled this person, that person, this person like how how did you achieve that, you know, as far as like, you know, battling wise, you battled so much and, you know, gained so many views and shit like that, man, and the status that you're in is, is at a I high level. I think it's level. a mixture of I think it's a mixture of like me being seen. When people see you a lot, they tend to follow you and watch what the hell you're doing. I got a dope supportive ass squad. Like my team's crazy to always promote and shit and putting new people onto battles and stuff too. I think it's a mixture of a, of a couple different things. You know what I mean? Um, I I don't know. Like I know people. Lot some people bust their ass too, even more battling than me and don't get as much views. And stuff. It's not always about me wearing dresses because people like to try to play me and say that that's corny. Because off of Queen of the Ring, I don't wear dresses and I still get like decent views off of them for the small ass leagues who don't have a bunch of subscribers and stuff. You know what I mean? So mm-hmm. I think I've just built it to the. I'm a person that people fuck with, so they watch what I'm doing. I I try to stay active, but I really think that's I don't know. Mm-hmm. I don't know. 